Hello, it's me again. Hi, hi, yes. This was recorded before Tanacon, so that's why, like, honestly, I think Tanacon is like, uh, I don't know, there's some wrong in what is happening. Um, and I, like I said, I filmed this before Tanacon, so I didn't know anything, so like, yeah, I think that's a disclaimer. I don't want to talk a lot about it because I don't condone drama, haha. <laughs> right, me don't, not condoning drama, that's funny. Um, so yeah, uh, Hope you enjoyed the video. I'm so <laughs> Hi everyone. <laughs> so today we're going to do a video and we are going to follow Tana Mojo's makeup tutorial. <laughs> so you'll be asking Hannah, why are you doing this again? You've done James Charles because Tana Mojo is my Freaking icon. She's my role model. I love her. So I decided to do her makeup tutorial. Although I kind of don't agree on like some parts of her makeup tutorial, which like will ruin my skin. But this is why we're doing this. This is our goal. We're gonna try to ruin our skin. Okay. okay. All she uses is high end. I use like drugstore. I <laughs> can't Von D who you know. Benefit. I haven't heard of her. So Let's get started. This is the how to cake your face like a pro. The triology or triology. I don't know English. I'm Tana Mojo and I am filming this intro after getting done with my makeup so that when you clicked on the video, you weren't afraid. That's actually genius. Why haven't I thought of that? A little bit better doing my makeup. I thought that I'm doing We love a one. queen that's like good at makeup, you know? Like I bet if I do this routine, I'll look like a mess okay she used moisturizer i forgot to get my moisturizer downstairs which i can't be at ours to get so i'm not getting it sucks for you the first thing you're gonna do is use some hand sanitizer because why the f would you wash your hands when you could just like not you know i never put hand sanitizer before i put on my makeup because i don't know i'm scared what if i break out from hand sanitizer but it's fine Thank you for time. then i'm gonna use the it's by NYX. It's called First Base and it's a primer spray. I only have like rose water because I'm like, I'm poor, so we're just gonna put it on our face. I'm gonna ruin my. Oh my god, I'm gonna ruin my setup. Oh my god. Now we're all dewy and sisterly. I should stop. Do we just love Tana more? Do we love Tana? Like, if you don't love Tana, unsubscribe. I'm joking, please subscribe. <laughs> because I'm desperate. Love that. Okay, now we're gonna put way too much on our hand. Excuse me. I, that's why I don't wear primer because it doesn't do anything to my skin. She's using the Marc Jacobs foundation, which is like $50, and I'm actually really poor and I cannot afford that. So I have the Wet n Wild foundation. She says it covers your face like paint. It's, 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 like, it's like paint. And this smells like paint, so like it's unsanitary because it has this thing on it. This thing has like a wand. Same thing as the Marc Jacobs, so like it's the same thing. But here's the catch. It's worse. This foundation is really cakey on me unless I get for like a little bit. This is like really light on me. It doesn't suit me at all. But it does suit my neck. No, never mind. My neck is really dark too. A bird just like flew by. Okay. Just like thought you wanted to know that. Like a flirt just a flirt. A bird just flew by. Just put this all over my face. Use way too much. Like that's the goal. <laughs> Why did I say it? Put this all Put over this my all face. Use way, way too, too much. much. Like, that's the goal. Anything with Tana. A giant gash in my beauty blender because Lumen tried to eat this. In my beauty blender because Lumen caught her. And I why? Why? Well, if you're Malaysian, you'll, like, understand this. All the workers, the makeup workers that are, like, Malaysian. I mean, like, Malaysian stores. Totino shade. Usually, usually, the lightest color that doesn't match your skin at all. And they say it's your skin color. Like, what? I don't know why Malaysians, they think like light tone colors are like their skin color. I don't know. Like that's just my opinion. Says the person that has actually been guilty of this. We love being hypocritical. That's like my goal in life, you know, like hypocrisy. We love that. Look how cakey this is. So, um, we're done. We're looking 
white. This looks so bad. Flat top synthetic brush. I think I used this in my last video. And like go all around my skin and like swirl the foundation around. Just because I'm super anal about like anything looking straight. Tana, no, no, Tana, no, 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 no. no. Wow. wow! I'm sorry, I'm not bashing her or anything. Her makeup looks great. Like, it actually looks really good on this. But it doesn't look good on me. It won't look good. On okay, I'm just, I'm just gonna do it. Who cares? I need for YouTube. You know? <laughs> Age Rewind just because I want to. But she uses the Age Rewind finally. She uses drugstore like me. Oh, great. That's great. That was amazing. Blend this in. I don't go over this with a brush because I like to just like really lightly press it into my skin so that it's like I don't like to move it around everywhere. I like it to be like exactly where I placed it. I don't want to make a scene. I don't want to let you down. Trying to do my own thing and I start to figure it out. Uh, uh. This is so random, but like, I haven't heard about like Jake Paul and Logan Paul in a while. Like, 2017, they were like blowing up. Everyone was like, oh, oh like, Logan Paul's my king, you know? Like, my actual king. And now everyone's like, <gasps> so can we just talk about the flashback Mary that's going on? <laughs> They're irrelevant, and I'm like, what? He still gets views, he still gets like 7 million or whatever, but... I don't know what point I'm trying to get to, but I think I'm saying... <laughs> I love how I don't know what I'm saying. I think I'm like saying how... It's not talked around anymore, you know? Like, ages ago, like, whenever he uploads a video, it's like, oh, he uploaded that, and I was like, oh, okay. Like, he a shade room, I mean, pff, YouTube shade room or whatever. And now, like, it's like dusty. Like, no one talks about it. It's... It was a fat burp. Set my face. I don't think that I took pictures or when you like Snapchat. I love it so much that I have two of it. I have the brush. I'm just gonna use the brush that I swirled my foundation in. Oh, I just put this on this brush and I go in. I don't really know. So she takes the thing and puts it on her face. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm scared of myself. Flashback Mary, but we're not gonna talk about that. Flashback Mary is amazing. We treat all people equally. Aliens, ghosts, Flashback Mary, humans. Equality. It makes me, I'm great to this and I, it is the best contour in the world. I lost this. PG, please. I'm 10. I'm 10. The powder that I use in this palette is entirely gone. <laughs> like, this was like full the other day. She doesn't say what contour shade she used, but I'm gonna use my normal one, which is like the lightest one. This in the like 3C. I keep saying like UC She does it really aggressively, which is like me, honestly. It's very fast and vigorous because I feel like that makes it blend better, but like it totally doesn't actually. Love my life. I don't wanna make a scene. That's why I'm gonna make a notorious with my. Life. I used to love Tori, but honestly, when I rewatched the show, when I was like binge watching the show, she looks so cringy. I don't know, she's just cringy. It's really weird, and like to put this on my eyelids. I feel like it makes the rest of my face look more tan if like right here isn't super white, and then I like do my brows, and then I do like the concealer thing, but then it's like darker. I don't know, okay? I also think it makes my shit. Okay, okay, so, okay. So, so, so. Contour again, and we're gonna put it on our eyelids because we're Tana. You just love. I don't know. Then I just like to take the yellow powder in the middle and put that on the tops of my cheekbones and then on the bridge of my nose, part of my chin, and that is what a freshly contoured face looks like. So she uses the Naked Basics palette, which I don't have, like I said, because I am broke. Bro, bro, can you understand that? that? This eyebrow powder, which is from Gazo, and it was only. One dollar. Ted doesn't conceal her brows, so like. I don't know how I'm gonna work with this. If it was me, I'd conceal my brows, but like she doesn't, so like we're just gonna try to not die. She doesn't use a spoolie, so I'm going to use a spoolie because uh, this is not cheating. There's no mirror here, and why am I looking? That's actually you see through. What am I doing? <laughs> You're gonna be really sad that you will never be eyebrow goals. That's as good as it gets. You know, you can't have your cake and eat it too. Is it just me, or like I'm not a trend type of person? I mean, yes, I kind of follow like. Makeup trend, like trendy things, you know. But like, if it becomes like too much, I hate it. I don't like it, especially TV shows, movies, people. Like, make me hate it in general. I don't know why. Like, I loved One Direction, but when like they became too overrated, and then Five Sauce came and they were like such a little bad. Oh my god, they were so cute. 
collection was actually so overrated though not like it's a bad thing like i love them so much and still like they were my stands have you heard their old album their og album it's girl you need to move on you don't have to become like a typical fangirl so Oh no, my brow powder. Oh no, it's fine. Girl, you cannot be like those typical fangos, you know? So I was like, have ah, five sauce. It's like Stranger Things, honestly. I'm not trying to bash Stranger Things if you're a Stranger Things stan like me. Like I was a stan. Like I even had a fan account for Stranger Things. I'm not even joking. Things I love Mike. I love Eleven. Like they were my babies. I love them so much. But they became like too overrated. I mean, the only actor that I currently really love right now is Noah. He's like so talented in season two. He's like a kid. How can he like act like that? I'm older than him, I think. Am I? Am I? Oh my god, I'm two years older than him. How? Why? He's so mature. Oh, oh, I thought he was like 15, but he's actually like. 14 or 13, I don't know. And, and I still don't know how to act. Like, ooh, I'm gonna sh wait, let me, I'm gonna try to act right now. Uh, what was that? He's such a professional. I love Noah so much. But, like, people like Millie, Finn. Season one, it was like, ha ah, Stranger Things, yes, Queen, you know, like I watched it when it first came out and I was in love with it, but like I wasn't that in love, you know, I was like, oh, it's so good, but like I'm still waiting for like season two so I can like rate it more. And then a year later, season two came out and then it was the bomb, like I loved it, so I just don't like overrated things because people keep talking about it and I'm like, oh my god, shut up, we get heated. It's like, you know, whenever you listen to a song like 10,000 times a day and then like you start to hate that song because you listen to it every single day. That's the feeling with me with overrated things. If it's like creativity, like makeup, like it's fine. You know? Besides the eyebrows, because the eyebrows are like so dumb. It's like eyeshadow trends, like a cut crease, a flower crown. That's like cute. Like it's art. We're talking about like Stranger Things, One Direction, um, Marvel. It became. This was supposed to be a Tana video. Okay, I should. I should. Like, Actually, last week I created this motivational quote, and I think I'm going to touch it on being a before. It's almost inspiring. Kylie Cosmetics bronze palette and I'm excited because I'm Kylie Jenner trash so this isn't really gonna be like an eyeshadow tutorial I'm gonna kind of tell you where I'm putting things and like hopefully it looks good but I don't think I'm comfortably good enough at eyeshadow yet to where I can explain to you guys like how to do it and like be confident in it like I feel like I'm gonna get a lot of hate like oh my god the eyeshadow sucks so bad the fact that she thought this was like a tutorial like what a dumb bitch so like this is how I'm doing it like if you want to do it you can that's actually me like I bet if I'm like more famous I get so much hate so I'm so grateful that like I'm irrelevant because no one can attack me for everything I've done wrong. I swear to God, if I'm famous, kids can be problematic sometimes. I don't know if I was recording the whole time. I, I forgot what, what topic we were on, honestly. Um, so, yeah, that's the tea. She's using the Kylie Jenner palette. And I think the new beach palette by the bomb is kind of similar. I don't know, it has like orange. I try to do it anyways because we're a beauty guru. It's like orange. Oh, you can see the... You can you can see the um, fallout. That's great. She applies her eyeshadow like this. I'm not trying to like teach her anything. Oh my god, I'm 12. I don't know anything about makeup. Like that's not how I do it or like most people do. But she does it like this, and then she. Okay, we're gonna try to do that because we're 10 up. <laughs> Guys, should I make like a part two? I cannot speak English because everybody is laughing at that. I'm like, I'm sorry, I cannot speak English. You know? <laughs> I keep stuttering and saying the wrong words, and I don't know, I just say it without thinking. That's another reason why I do mistakes all the time because I say things without thinking. It's so dumb. In editing, I can remove the mistakes that I've done. I. <laughs> real life I cannot because that's human you know I still kind of want to touch the topic on overrated things since Infinity War came out Marvel has been like so popular everyone has been talking about it I always watch Marvel but like I've never become a fan of it until I saw Spider-Man Homecoming Tom Holland my actual king please come to my house and kidnap me or like punch me or something and I would say sorry to you I'm not even joking please that's my life goal that is my address please come to my house love you babe like, since Spider-Man Homecoming came out like last year I've been like Tom Holland
Homecoming, you know, like I love him with all my heart and I love Spider-Man Homecoming, like all the Marvel movies and I was like, ooh, it's like sexy, like the, these movies are like so good, you know? But yeah, whenever I like watch the videos, I just bust like a I'm actually trying so hard to understand why I just sat there, but I just can't. Infinity War was like teasing us and I was like, oh, this is good. Like I never thought like it was the biggest movie. Like I don't pay attention to anything in life. My brother is such like a big Marvel fan. He's always like, watch this, watch that. And I was like, no, no they're like for kids. Uh -huh. Yo, I'm like an adult. Don't tell me what to do. Like that was my mindset. And so I watched one of the movies and I was like, oh, this is good. You know, like I should stop hating on them and try to be kind of open-minded and not hate on them so i did and then when it became really overrated i kind of lost interest in marvel like no offense <laughs> oh my god speaking of talking i talk like so much all my friends are like oh my god you talk so fast like you're not doing show like stop it this is why i edit so much because i have to edit like how i talk and how like I have to repeat every single thing because you won't understand me, you know? Or like I have to add a voiceover and be like that, I'm I'm saying this, I'm, you know? Literally what I just did two minutes ago. I stutter and mumble a lot and it's bad. That's a bad habit, I don't know why I do it. I'm gonna take this really shimmery like bronzy color and put that in my outer corner. Okay, this doesn't look as dark as Tana, so I'm gonna take this. Reason, what is that? Brazen. <laughs> Also, shout out to Karina. I love her with all my heart. Like, I gave her my number. Like, she's so sweet. Nice. Like, what a queen. Follow her fan page. Follow her meme. Like, honestly, follow her everywhere. You know, like, give her love. If, like, you see this. And if this turns viral, hopefully it does turn viral because I want Karina to deserve everything. You know, like, she's such a queen. I love her so much. I don't know. I want to meet her. I don't know. Does she live in Paris? I have bad memory, okay? I don't even remember my best friend's birthday. That's, like, so bad. Oh, my God. I, like, zoomed in on my eye. You can't really see what I'm doing. It's because it doesn't really look that good. So, I want to be like, zoom down and far away so you think it looks good like that's that's what I'm going for burnt red brownish color and focus it on my very outer corner don't we just like my eyeshadow? Also, like I'm really allergic to eyeshadow. Like I'm not even joking. When eyeshadow hits my eye, I put eyeshadow on my eyes anyway. But like whenever it hits inside my eye, or like whenever I put it under, it actually hits my eyeball. I get red eye and I basically die. You know. <laughs> generous lips you know like i hate my lips with a passion and they're so chapped right now i hate it they look tiny as ever they literally look like um actual kylie jenner's lips so please ignore it i'm gonna get lip injections tomorrow because i'm like 18 i mean i'm like 17 like like kylie jenner got her lip injection when she was like 17 i think so like i'm gonna copy her steps because she's like my role model like i love her so much like i don't get people why do they bully like people who have no lips and then like when they get like lip injections they still bully them for like getting lip injections you know like make up your mind like if you don't like people with like small lips then like why do you bully them and like when they're insecure about it because you bully them and then they get like lip injections or like surgery and then you bully them more you're like oh my god you're like fake why did you get like lip surgery you know like then why did you bully her in the first place for like getting him works too like honestly it's not like just her boys included as well why do you bash people who have like small lips or like a big nose and then when they like get it, surgery and then you bully them for getting surgery like i don't understand that i've never stopped using kiss number 11 eyelashes and then i think my sentence like, like i look so bad with like no eyelashes like look at this like this is a monkey you see okay monkeys are cute sometimes but like, this is a mole rat story time i love being tanner right now don't you have this plastic this is so dumb i Everyone's gonna scream at me and be like, this won't help. But like, I lost the cap to my duo glue, and I'm not gonna just leave it like that because this duo glue was expensive, okay? I'm broke. It, things like this is expensive. And I lost the cap, so I put it in this plastic bag just in case it doesn't dry up, you know? Like, I just love my life, you know? I'm amazing. Like, no cap. Like, that's great. Following your mom's moves. Why eyelash glue that dries clear is a lie. It just like dry. Clear, it dries like clear mixed with your foundation and then it looks like someone came in your eye we've had this conversation in the eye it's not a good look tana like should stop bullying me but like she's my mom so like she can like say whatever she wants Okay, we're gonna put our eyelashes, eyelash, eyelashes, why did I say eyelashes? Why did I say eyelashes? That was- I think the glue dried too fast. That's like great. That's like amazing. That's so good. Plan, don't let the eyelash glue dry up too fast. No joke, this video's gonna take like five years to like edit, but like that's fine, you know, because I have to like 
cut out my mistakes, cut out everything, every mistake that I've ever done in this video. So go follow my Instagram if you haven't. It's DTF for Hannah. And that's the tea. I'm gonna try to apply these lashes and then I'll come back. Okay, bye. So my makeup. <laughs> she wore lipstick. Okay, so she wore this like MAC honey whatever lipstick. Also, by the way, my camera's being ugly. I don't know why, why my camera hates me. Put mascara on her bottom lashes, which is what we're gonna do. I have like no bottom lashes, but we're gonna try anyways. <laughs> But we just like love the Asian line, like that's amazing. Leave the mascara cakey, you know, because like that's the look we're going for. Like, my hair's the worst, and that's the tea. So hopefully you like my Tana video. <laughs> I have like one bar on my camera, so it's gonna die. Like honestly, it's really cakey. That's not my kind of like coverage or like. Hope you really like the thumbs up. Not forget to so much. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm disgusting. Okay, bye.